तो इनके घर से हम औरतों के बेट में जो बच्चा है कोक में से निकाल के मारेंगे तो इन स्वरों की करो विदाई You may have noticed in a lot of my other videos exposing the uh, murderous death cult of Hinduism and I'll say, you know, that essentially there's no difference between Hinduism and Islam and it's true and that's, that's what this video is mainly about. But the reason why I'm making this video is, is due to the fact that you'll see in a lot of my videos exposing the death cult of Islam is that I'm mentioning a lot of uh, articles by counter jihad websites because they do have a lot of good stuff uh, showing the true side of Islam that the politically correct media is too afraid to show apparently just the true side of the fact that Islam is a uh, basically the Ishmaelite uh, false religion you know it's wild men Genesis 16 verse 11 to 12 but the problem is is that that they have a um, the thing about the counter jihad movement is that they have a very strong uh, attitude of like en the enemy of my enemy is my friend so essentially they're against Islam but essentially like anything that's like against Islam they're for so you'll see a lot they're shilling for the Hindus you know they're shilling for the false religion of Hinduism because they're persecuting uh, the Muslims and also being targeted by the Muslims so it's the kind of thing where it's like if it's against Islam then it must be good you know and it kind of and, and a lot of times it actually comes down to the, to a willful ignorance of the fact that Hinduism is every bit as bloodthirsty and demonic as Islam because I've seen these guys outright deny that Hinduism is a terroristic religion despite after showing you know kind of seeing some stuff but the fact that Hinduism uh, because you can just do a quick Google search on Hindu terror, just go on images, and you'll see it, it'll shatter any kind of illusion that Hinduism is a peaceful religion. So a lot of times it just comes down to a willful ignorance. But, you know, this kind of a mentality that, oh, it, it's not real, they're just a peaceful, you know, pluralistic people that are, you know, being targeted by the Muslims. No, they're both equally as demonic and violent. Hinduism and Islam are just two sides of the same Luciferian Jesuit coin, just two daughters of the same harlot over there in the Vatican, over in Rome. And you know, all roads lead to Rome. Hence, while the Pope is welcome in India and, and engages in Hindu rituals, but you know this this kind of enemy, my enemy is my friend mentality, it does leave a, a willful blind spot because it, it, in the age of the internet, there really is no excuse for kind of this kind of ignorance because you can just Google Hindu terror, and the first thing that comes up is a Wikipedia article about it. So, you know, it, it is very prevalent, but it's always been at the back of my mind. You know, and it is why I do my videos, but. It's just really homing in the fact that there is no difference. I've shown enough proof that the fact that, you know, you criticize Hinduism in India, you'll, you'll have a film come out that, you know, makes fun of Hinduism, and the reaction from Hindus is basically no different than the reactions of Muslims over in Pakistan when, you know, someone makes fun of their false prophet. So, I wanted to point that out. Uh, the enemy of my enemy is my friend mentality is certainly not a scriptural attitude to have when it comes to dealing with false religion. I'll just point that out as well. So, just been at the back of my mind, wanted to get that out there. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.